IK from IMK Technical Hub and in this video I will show you that how to add a sky to your background images. The image can be the renderings or anything else. So let's get started. So first of all what you have to do, you have to open an image which you want to edit sky. So I will open that image file and open in Photoshop. The image is in desktop. This is the image. Click open. So you can see the image that uh, has not. Uh, th this is a PNG image. So I will add a sky to this image. You can see there is a white portion from all side. I will crop this out so that I only want to see my building. click yes so now I will add sky to this image and for the sky you can google it which sky do you want to put your images so you can see I have searched for sky and images and here what you have to do you can go to tools option and here you can go to size larger than 4 megapixel so these are skies which uh, very high pixels so you can put in your images with very high resolutions so that it will not fade out so click on the sky which you want to add to your image in photoshop so if i want to add this image or i will look for you can see the image is like this and for this image i think Also, you can see the light is coming like this. It's a lot of light. So, I think I will put. Uh, so, you can see there is a lot of uh, images. I will select uh, one of them. And I uh, think this looks good. Click on this. So you can see the image, click on this image and save as JPEG, click open. Now open with, Adobe Photoshop. Now what you have to do, you have to select it control a and then you have to go to edit and then you can see the define pattern option click on this and name it something if you want i will leave it sky or something blue click ok and then you have to go to your image if you want to edit the sky click on the magic wand tool and select the white portion and you can see there is something also select Go to this option and select minus and then remove it also you can see this white portion has been left click on the magic wand again select plus option and select this ok now what you have to do, you have to right click and layer by copy, make a layer, click on this layer, double click and then go to pattern overlay. You can see the pattern here goes here but I want that sky. So you can also last thumbnail or small thumbnail and see you can see this blue sky which we have downloaded and now from here we will scale it down or scale it up 
you can see also if you want move the button to the image and you can from here you can move you can see there are two skies coming so I will scale it up something about 45 or and then you can adjust how you want so this is a way you can add sky to the image I think the the clouds are very large as compared to this building so we have to choose sky which has smaller cloud also I have some other sky that I can add to this so you can see this is the one now I can move it like something this this look, looks quite good so I will scale it up something so you can see we can see the ground line it did something like this and if you want you can also add some more sky or leave it something like this so that's look quite good and click on ok so you can see we have add an sky to this images and also I'm scrolling with my scroll wheel if you want to scroll like this what you have to do you have to click on keyboard control K this this is a tips which I also want to tell you and then you have to go to the tools option and here you can see the option zoom with scroll with click on this and click OK so now if you want you can scroll with the scroll tool you can zoom in, in and zoom out with the scroll wheel rather than pressing the alt key so these are tips and uh, this is a way you can add the sky to this image also if you want some trees or anything else uh, the entourage you want to add this image you can also image the file and open the png images so i hope this video is useful you can now easily add sky to the images i hope this video is useful thank you for watching